Hey there, it's Brian Gormley with Cornerstone Properties and CapitalShortSale.com. Uh, I get this question a lot and the uh, on, on short sales. And the question is, how do I choose a real estate agent to handle my short sale? Well, it's a good question. Not all real estate agents are created equal. Uh, many people will advertise themselves as short sale experts, short sale specialists. Uh, we've done short sales, we negotiate, you know, blah, blah, blah. Unfortunately, that a lot of times is just positioning and folks, you know, wanting wanting business, but not really having any idea how to negotiate, uh, even even knowing what documents are needed for a short sale, how to escalate files, how to get deficiencies waived, and so on. So it's very important that you do your research, you interview your potential real estate agent. Uh, as it turns out in Maryland, the Maryland Association of Realtors, uh, their policy is that real estate agents cannot negotiate short sales. So you really want to get, if you can, uh, you know, an attorney involved because there are a lot of legal aspects to this. Uh, deficiency judgments, tax implications, credit implications, and so on. And I detail a lot of those on my blog, CapitalShortSale.com. I encourage you to take a look at them. Uh, we at Cornerstone, just to put a little shameless plug out there, we do cover all of Maryland, uh, D.C., Northern Virginia. Uh, I'm an attorney and a broker, and I've got uh, agents who are trained under me. Uh, we negotiate short sales, of course, for, for folks and um, handle the, uh, you know, the listings and sales as well. Uh, we're not the only game in town. I'd encourage you to uh, you know, research and uh, interview others as well. Uh, but you want to make sure that you ask uh, really pointed questions. How many short sales have you done? What sort of obstacles have you overcome? Um, this is the details of my property. How many liens are there? Is there a mortgage insurance? Are there other judgments involved? HOA, is it current, is it late? Uh, you know, what's the value of my property? These are the sorts of questions that you want to ask. Uh, you know, even do you have experience with my particular lenders? Uh, and, uh, you know, assess their track record. You get a feel pretty fast of how they approach a short sale negotiation simply by asking a few open-ended questions and listening. Uh, you'll, you'll hear people who really know what they're doing and it'll, it'll show and then you'll hear other people who really don't and that's the, um, that's the difference. So that's what I'd encourage you to do. Check out our site CapitalShortSale.com. Lots of free information. Um, you can look on the uh, webinar, 45-minute webinar, get started with a short sale. Uh, that's a tab under our CapitalShortSale.com site, uh, along with lots of other free information and resources uh, that you should avail yourselves of. Uh, thanks very much for listening, and um, I hope I can uh, be of assistance to you in the future. Bye-bye.